If you thought all ants were just a minor nuisance, think again. An invasive species that can cause serious allergic reactions has made its way to central Georgia. Hunter King went to Houston County to tell us more about this antagonizing new threat. They're small, they're black, and they pack a potentially dangerous sting. The Asian needle ant has been quietly spreading across Georgia for decades. We've noticed over the past couple years uh, an uptick in the number of uh, identifications. Unlike most ants you might find in your home, these aren't just a nuisance. Dan Suter, a professor at the University of Georgia, says their sting can cause serious health problems. I had received three calls last year from homeowners who had suffered anaphylaxis from the sting of this ant. That anaphylaxis is a severe allergic reaction that can be life-threatening. For Warner Robins resident Naya Johnson, the news is concerning. I mean, it's crazy. I don't, I don't fool with bugs. Yes, if they poisonous, I don't want to be stung a bit by nothing like that. So you might be wondering where exactly are these ants hanging around? The professor says they're usually in wooded areas like this, and some of them are even around big oak trees. Unlike fire ants that build visible mounds in sunny areas, these invaders are harder to spot. The ants are about 3 16ths of an inch long. They're solitary foragers, often appearing to wander alone. I'm going on about my everyday life. I don't care. As long as I don't get bit by it. These ants are most active during the summer months of July and August, but experts say if you do encounter these ants, don't try and handle the problem yourself. Reporting in Warner Robins, Hunter King, 13 WMAZ News. Experts say to keep an eye on children if they're outside playing and to wear closed toe shoes. If you believe you found Asian needle ants in your yard, they recommend taking a photo and contacting your county extension office for proper identification.